Andrea Isoni, PhD, a director of AI Technologies. And you know, this is a company that's specializing in solving data-related problems for startups and, and established companies. He published a book on machine learning called Machine Learning for the Web, published by Pact, and is published in English, Chinese, and Korean. I'd like to welcome Andrea Sony to the stage. Andrea is the director of AI Technologies, working with brands and companies to help them better navigate and harness the full potential of AI. Please join me in welcoming Andrea. How many of you have heard at least the name Data Science? Okay, most of you. So Data Science is more broader in the sense they include machine learning, but it's more broader in the sense they can also have tool of visualization technique in which I'm able to distinguish piece of data cleverly. And statistic, you need a lot of statistics also to do these things. Start from the customers and then go back. In this case of the AI, start from your angle, what you want to do, detail that, phrase it, exact detail, will never be enough details, and then go to a consultant and say, that's what I want to do, what can we do together? It's very easy to forget why it was important in the first place. Because you are getting your mind or your team mind into solving the actual technical stuff. They almost you forget why the business was valuing the solution in itself. And the other thing is called on the right the brain computer interface. So you may know that anytime you have a thought, you emit some um, waves. And then maybe you will meet some ways so you can link your fault to your way. So essentially, with this system, you can just communicate at the speed of your fault. So whenever you want to design an AI or you want to use them, be aware that whatever you have the bias in mind is going to be translated and shifted in any tool you are going to use. It should be your decision, your design, and needs to avoid or consciously, consciously do it but still has to be your responsibility. Have you heard about Thai? There was the Microsoft bot that started to insult people. It was because it was learning from the other people that were insulting on Twitter. <laughs> it's the same thing. It's the same thing. It's not about the, the, how can you remove the data. We need to improve, and then as consequence, the machine will improve. In programming, there's a word called debugging, which the right definition is understand exactly what I say to computer to do. Because this is the part, it's not a computer that uh, is mad. I say something wrong, I didn't understand, I say to him. We need to do the bugging on ourselves. Cyber is a scary word for many, but what it essentially means, it doesn't necessarily mean we need a chip inside our brain or under our skin. It means you're becoming more and more intimate with the technology. This is the level of intimacy we have now. We can't even live with our home. It's important to be concerned because we are going to do things better if we are concerned. But if we need to be scared and worry now, like panicking, I say no, it's an exaggeration, come on. Everyone knows us, knows that his computer still has a problem to connect to the printer. So it's not the moment yet. 